you know, to, to, to check, you hold it up to the light. Oh, to look for the holes? Yeah, that makes sense. Exactly. Oh, man, look at that jacket. The Pro Line? Yep. Would you make a deal if I just bought all the CDs? Hi, how are you? I think the only thing it's missing is there's like a squeegee thing to do hard. Gotcha. Huh. Okay. It works. We just we got it upright. So. Okay. All right. I'll think about it. Thank you. Is this uh, Donald Duck towel for sale? I don't know. I'll see. Is it Donald Duck towel for sale? Or it caught my eye. I'd buy it if you'd sell it. $50. Sold. I'll take it. That's cool. I'll add it to my pile. <laughs> Love a good dad joke. Here, I'll put this over here. Oh, thank you so much. What's my damage? Uh, right now, 975. 975? I'll just round it up to 10 to make it easy. Um, would you go 10 on the um, carpet cleaner thing? Out there? I'm, I'm just a helper. <laughs> gotcha. Uh, Can I the carpet cleaner thing? Sure. Okay, so I owe you 20 of them. That's mine. Thank you. There you go. Do you want the box? Yeah, thank you so much. $20. Yep, Good luck with the sale. Thank you. Thanks for stopping. Name, is this your dog? Did this come with it? Well, somebody gave it to me, so I have no idea. Oh, somebody gave you the dog? Mm -hmm. Interesting. Did they? Did you put the clothing on it, or was it like that? It was like that. Yeah, I didn't. With the with with that and everything. Interesting. I saw it had a Disney tag on the bottom. Made me curious. Yes. Mm -hmm. You know what? I'll buy it. Maybe 15 more. It's, it's going to cherry, so thank you. Of course. Thank you so All much. Right, thank you. Morning.
much is your blender? Um, I would say, I mean, with the food processor and the blender and stuff, maybe like 30 is fine, 25, 30. Get rid of it. I'll do 25. Okay. You good with that? 25 yeah, for the blender? Yeah. There you go. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Very much. Do you want a bag for it? Um, I should be able to haul it okay. out. It's all right. Okay. I got some bags in the car. Okay, cool. Thank you. I'm going to run and get my phone with me. What are you asking on the harnesses? Um, I think like 20 bucks. 20 bucks each? Yes. Okay. Um, and I have four total. Um, I just put the two out. Um, they were used as, uh, they were, they've never been used. They were used on a, a movie for uh, parachuting gear. No kidding? Um, uh, so, yeah. But I've got four total. Um, How much are your bucks? So like, I uh, just three bucks for all this. Bike. I'll do that. Yeah. There you go. Thank you. Thank you. Morning. Morning. How you doing? Good about yourself. Good, thanks. You buy these online? Um, yeah, most of them actually off of a TikTok shop. Interesting. Yeah. Good, thanks. How are you? Good. So there's a couple of um, TikTok shops that do like live broadcasts. Okay. Um, and then they they used to sell them in like scoops, so uh -huh. like a surprise. Oh. But my favorite shop actually didn't do that. They just sold them in like lots, so yeah. that you could like pick which ones you wanted. But um, I have a lot <laughs> and I still have a lot inside. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so I was like, okay, I, I really have to like um, go through and you know, weed out <laughs> what I don't need. Sure, sure. I have doubles of and yeah, have a good one. things that um, the crystal just doesn't have a lot of meaning to me and things like that. So. Hmm. Have a good day, thanks. Thank you. Now, if I carry these things for him to his car, he has to chip it. Oh, there you go. He he needs to chip it. I don't need it. Let's be honest. I buy it. I was having it on for myself. My boy passed away. Three or four of us. For the squaw valleys, I'm asking thirty each. Thirty dollars each. Yeah. Okay. You know, to, to, to check, you hold it up to the light. Oh, to look for the holes. Yeah, that makes sense. Exactly. You can see it if there's any that way, but there's there's none in these. Okay. Oh, you see some of that loading stuff that the bag was sitting here this morning. Yeah. 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 You sold your songs for stuff. What did you say for all of the, the stories? Oh, about the book. Book. About the book. Or maybe an offer if you want the whole box or the whole lot. Oh, there's a lot of this. About 100, 120 stories. I didn't count. I have no idea. That's Roseville, but it's the other thing, the other one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. 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 I, I don't remember what it is. Oh, you carry, you well, I carry the heavy one. Oh, it's You're beautiful. Mm -hmm. You're asking 300 on that? Yes, I am. It's a and new it piece. Works. Yeah. If you're interested, we'll plug it in. Thanks a lot, man. This one and this That's one. That's my 50 yep. cent box. Okay. Thanks you. a lot. Thank you. You have a good day. You too. How about thanks, for, thanks for shopping with us. Uh -huh. Welcome to Walmart. <laughs> the 
those are sample, rock samples of semi-precious stones. Interesting. From Stern, so like if a kid collect, had a rock collection. Huh. There's like the amethyst, and I don't know. I don't even know what all they are in there. But those are, you know, like thumb size, end of your thumb size. Those are copper. Those are neat. All right, I got a little pile going all here. Right. I'll buy all that. I'll keep looking around and see what else I can find. That's for panning gold. Huh. The old-fashioned ones. Yeah. Nowadays, they sell plastic ones. Do you sell on eBay? Is that kind of where your prices no. are based on? No, I don't sell on eBay. I mean, I look. Sometimes I'll think, you know how you use Google Lens? Mm -hmm. And you, I kind of look and see what things are maybe going for. Sure. I don't know. So it's a crapshoot. I don't know what everything is worth. So if there's something you're interested in, feel free to make an offer. Worth what somebody will pay for it, right? Exactly. Is that a desk set? Yeah. That's neat. Mm -hmm. All right. I owe you two, four, five, six dollars. Okie dokie. Thank you. Thank you. Good luck with the sale. Thank you very much. I found some stuff. I got some already in your car. These are two pieces here I got kind of for myself. I don't think they're really that great resale, especially that. That was more like a Home Depot, I mean, a, a Hobby Lobby thing. But that's a nice, heavy metal frame shelf that mounts to a wall. That is cool. It is. It is. I got it for four. Or Somebody's stuff. coming. I'm going to shut the door. Oh, yeah. I got it for four. <clears throat> you can do something with it. You're more than welcome to take it. Oh man, look at that jacket. The Pro Line? Yep. Great find, Dad. How much? Or no, two. Two? That's a great that find. Stuff together. You got it for 15. You got, you got another jacket? jacket? This is a Dockers. Dockers? I love this thing. I got it for four. I'd say keep I'd it. I'd say you can get. Dockers are I'm harder just, to sell. I'd say keep it. Yeah, I love it. I'll yeah, keep it. it. Oh, I got your Blue Moon sign. I know that's not Oh, that's a lot cool. No, that'll do uh, good. Two brand new, uh, expensive brand shirts. Nice. Tags and all. Got them 10 each, they sell for 40 to 50 on eBay. Heck yeah. And, and, and that's everything. I just made the best find of the day. I'm going to buy you for 50 cents. Oh! <laughs> that's a heck of a deal, man. How you doing? Hi. How much is your uh, rolling duffel bag? The rolling duffel bag? Um, ten. Ten bucks? Yeah. I'll buy that. Okay. I'll keep looking around too and see what else I can find. What are these? Those are all uh, window wall covers. Window wall? Yeah, window wall. Oh, window wall. Window wall. Gotcha. Huh. How much are your hats? This one is five and these are 15 each. 15 and five, okay. okay. How about your uh, bookends? Um, 40. 40? Yep. Gotcha. I think I'll just stick with the bag. Okay. There you go, thank you. Thank you. Good luck with the sale. Thank you. Morning. Good morning, how are you? Good by yourself. Oh, I trust you. <laughs> I had to test it. I have two of them behind me. Little thing, take notes. I don't know what all that stuff is, so if you see something, just give me an offer. Okay. I can never have too many cords and cables. Well, I, I think my husband did. Would you go a dollar for these two? And I owe you five for the shredder? Yeah. Right. Sounds good. 
There you go. Thank you. Thank you. Good luck with the sale. Thank you. Morning. Morning, how are you? Good, how are you doing? Good. I'm gonna start a pile of stuff. That's all right. That's some old cassettes, huh? Mm-hmm. I mean, they're uh, not the best ones, but... Yeah, CDs over here, too. Okay. Oh, that's a classic. There's Queen. Yeah. How much are these? Uh, I got 50 cents, maybe. Yeah, I'll do 50 cents. Keep adding to my pile here. I can set it off the table if it's easier. No, I don't that's mind. Fine. You're good. Crowd your table full of stuff. I like your music taste. Thank you. I've already seen three or four, but yeah, I'd buy that. Would you make a deal if I just bought all the CDs? Otherwise, you got to haul them back downstairs. Yeah. Look at this. I know there's over 300 there. So I'd go 250. Yeah, I'm not going to go that high. Okay. I appreciate it, though. I usually try to pay like about a quarter, 50 cents at the most when I'm buying them in bulk. We were in Germany yep. and there was a store that had vodka. You're not allowed to take pictures in there, uh -huh. but we did. And it was about 100 euros. Back at the house and I found a ton of stuff for the sale today. My dad was also hitting the same neighborhood as I was because there were so many houses in there that we kind of thought we'd divide and conquer and he found some good stuff too. At one sale I got some DVDs, some books. I really wanted to buy all of his CDs but the price that he was at, even if he was like willing to make a deal on all of them, I don't think there's any money to be made. I don't think there was enough like rock in there. There was a lot of pop and some country so I decided not to mess with it. Even at 50 cents a piece, I don't think it could have made profit, so I passed on uh, the CDs. But I'm happy with what I got there. I got some of these um, Zane Lamprey DVDs. He had a show, I think it was on Comedy Central, called Three Sheets. And these two right here, this is seasons one through three, and this is season four. Each of these are going for like 25 to 30 bucks each. And this one's not really going for a whole lot. I might just lot it up with one of the other ones. This Dream On, seasons one and two, is going for about 35 all of these books, I'm just going to be keeping for uh, my collection. Beatles, Clapton, ACDC, uh, Roberto Clemente, Peter Frampton, and uh, Sammy Hagar. And then under here is the Blue Moon sign that Dad found. Dad also got these uh, Joseph A. Banks shirts, new with the tags. I don't think he paid very much for these. Uh, one's Club Room, one's Joseph A. Banks. I think I can get probably $20, $30 each on those. Got this Donald Duck towel. This wasn't even for sale. It was just covering something up. I gave her two bucks for it, and I didn't see any sold listings i saw some active so that might not sell i don't know that got this really cool shelf this is a uh, rod iron on the sides i'm probably gonna put this on ebay because i don't think it's gonna cost too much to ship i'm hoping to get i don't know 30 or 40 for that got a little odds and ends trinkets i got some uh floppy disks new in the packaging i think these are only like 50 cents or a quarter there were some random stuff i got there like these rocks i only threw them in just to kind of round out the the price I was going to pay her because it was like going to be a dollar fifty and like just throw something else in to make it uh, an even two bucks from what I pulled out of that bin. I might lot these three together and hopefully get 20 bucks. I don't know if they have a really good sell through rate. Anytime I find cool old stuff like that, like computer stuff, I buy it. Um, at this other sale, I also got this Queen cassette for 50 cents. That should bring about 10. I got some Parker pen and pencil sets. These do really good. Um, probably 20 to 30 for each of those sets. This was an interesting find. This is an old. Parker Brothers 
Nerf football. Um, it does. It is beat up a little bit. I think I only paid like 75 cents or 50 cents for this. It was a bundle deal. This is going for about 20, but there's a two-toned like red and orange one that goes for like 50. So keep an eye out for the old Nerf footballs. I got these uh, measuring cups just because they're copper. Uh, those are pretty cheap. A couple Frisbees. Um, IGA is a local grocery store. I don't know about this, to be honest. It was cheap enough. I'm like, eh, it might sell because it's, you know, advertising. This one right here is going for about 10 or 15. It's an old Whammo uh, Moonlighter. This was a good find. This is a Royal Shredder. I only had to pay five for this. These are going for $40 to $50. This is the type of stuff, if you're serious about reselling, this is what you want to be finding to make yourself some money because people look past this stuff all the time or they say, oh, it's too big. I don't want to mess with it to ship it. But if you can get $40, $50 plus shipping for this and you paid five for it, I'd buy that all day. Got some uh, miscellaneous reds things these were all stadium giveaways like these hats and this uh, backpack and this towel i'm just gonna keep all that this was an absolutely killer find by my dad this is a vintage um nfl pro line reversible pullover jacket uh for the jaguars unfortunately their team is horrible this season uh, but these things still sell really well this particular one i think i'll get probably around 50 dollars for but there's some that have um, like the shark tooth logo that just look killer that people are getting like two or three hundred hundred dollars each for so keep an eye out for the old uh, nfl pro line stuff this box was really interesting i got this all to garage sale i think it was mostly like 25 cents or 50 cents um i've done pretty well with this uh cross stitch stuff i'm sorry needle point um this one i think will bring about 10 and then she had all these um old decorations that I thought were really cool. This one I couldn't even find. I can't find it anywhere on eBay, but this is the time of year to be selling it. Um, Some St. Patrick's Day stuff, Easter, Valentine's, and then there's one more Halloween. This one's going for about 20 on eBay. This is a cool find. This is an L.L. Bean uh, duffel bag, and it had the tag on it somewhere. Here we go. L.L. Bean Rolling Adventure Duffel XL. $139, probably MSRP price. I saw these selling used for about 50 bucks. Um, this one's obviously still new with the tags. It does have a company logo. I'm sorry, the, um, I guess unless the Players Championship. It does have that logo on there. I don't think it's gonna hurt it too much. So I'm hoping to get 60 or 70 for that. I paid 10 bucks. Um, another thing that you probably were asking yourself, why is he buying this when you saw me buy it? This is a Bissell vacuum. Very rare, very, very rare. None of these listed, only one completed listing and that one sold for 105 bucks i think i got this for 10 it looks really clean it's got the other piece to it so yeah that's going to be a good return on the money and lastly i got this ninja it has all of the pieces very clean only paid 24 and that is selling for 100 i was editing this video and realized that i completely forgot to show you guys the santa paws dog that i got this thing is huge it's roughly i don't know 30 inches tall what caught my eye on this thing is the collar that it's wearing has this crystal and it says uh, Santa Paws. So I did some research. I could not find this same one anywhere. I thought it might have been vintage, but then when I looked at the tag, it has a uh, modern Disney tag. You can see that's definitely a modern tag. So this was from the first Santa Paws movie, which I think was like 2007. I'm probably giving you the wrong year, but I did look it up somewhere in the earlier 2000s for the uh, Santa Paws movie. I can't find any of these. So I did see similar Santa Paws dogs, uh, the plush that were doing pretty good. I'm going to try to list this for like, I don't know, $150 or best offer and uh, see if there's any takers with Christmas coming up. Hopefully somebody jumps on that. That's it for this video. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.